Hey YouTube, this is your president, the Presidential Tourist. And I thought, you know, since I had some extra time, I wanted to film like a kind of a video talking about what's been going on in my life, the direction of this channel, and everything. Um, if you're a keen observer of my channel, I'm sure there's a lot of people who don't observe it close enough to really notice as much. But you might notice, especially the last six months, there might have been some changes. There might have been more more days that might have been noticeable where I didn't upload a video, or you didn't see nearly as much Disney content, or things like that. First off, with regard to the Disney content, back in October or so, November maybe, I decided to back away from Disney a little bit, mainly because of um, you know COVID and everything. You know they were talking about that new Omicron variant, and it was more. Um, infectious and all. I don't worry about that with regard as much regard to me. Because a lot of you know, I take care of my mom. She lives with me. I don't live with her, she lives with me, I take care of her. And to be honest, you'd be surprised. Some people, a little bit critical of that, which I don't know, they're idiots in my opinion. I'm not gonna get into that now. But I decided that it's best to back away from places that was a bit more crowded because of that because I worry more about her and I uh, have to keep her as my priority so I don't worry about the virus as much with me but with her I do so I kind of didn't film that nearly as much in part of December into January February I kind of skipped about two months or so and then I've done a little bit since then here and there uh, a few days here a few days there not as much after I got farther along there's another reason uh, why I um, wasn't doing as much Disney. Okay, as you might have been noticing some of my recent videos, different backdrop here, different backdrop I've been doing in front of, uh, inside. Um, simply put, I have moved. And I'm still in Central Florida. It took <clears throat> forever to get the move complete. I was doing most of it by myself. It's a very long, arduous, and expensive process. But not that I did not just moved, I also bought a house. So I am now a homeowner. And as anyone who tried to recently buy one, you know it's tough in this uh, market, in this economy. Definitely was not a buyer's market. Low inventory and things like that. I won't get too specific into my situation with regard to that, but it was tough. Finally found a house that I liked here in Central Florida, and I was able to buy it. And I, that, so that disrupted a lot of things. I took so much time I had to put in that, you wouldn't believe it. And I guess I was doing a lot of the moving myself. Even just hiring movers and stuff is expensive and not that easy to do. Anyways, I pretty much have completed that. A few minor things here and there I got to still do with the house and I had to fix things up and things like that. Need some work done, so that took time. But I'm fairly happy with my situation. But that took a lot of time too. And I had to put some stuff off uh, that I wanted to do for this channel, uh, some different trips and things because of that. And the last couple of years, you all know, we all been dealing with this COVID world, which luckily it's gotten a lot better. It's not how it was to say in 2020, when you didn't know what really was going on fully but uh, yeah this last couple years has definitely has disrupted a lot of plans I want to get more to my channel what I wanted to do with COVID and as you know as you may have known the last couple years I lost my father and my brother and that put a real damper on things and had to I had to put my attention more towards other things now it may not seem to some like that because you see videos a lot on my channel almost every day but it has and also, you gotta also remember when I go to someplace like Disney, and I've gotten some questions about this, like how can I afford a Disney? How can I go to Disney all the time? I actually don't. I know there are some people who go to Disney every single day. There's some vloggers who go there every single day. I don't do that. It may seem like I do, or I go a lot, but I don't. You gotta keep in mind, when I go to Disney, I film content for sometimes eight, nine, ten videos or more. And if I upload them, day, you know, one a day, it may seem like, oh, he must be going to Disney every day or something. I don't, just let you know that. Uh, some will um, 
um, film at Disney, and, and they will um, put all one video, you know, show little pieces of what they did their day or they'll live stream it, and they'll do that every day, but not me. I give them all respect and, and props for doing that, going to Disney every day, but I couldn't. It, I tell you, Disney's fun, I enjoy it, but also it's a lot of work. You do a incredible amount of walking around, standing in line. There's a lot of people, it's usually hot. So, but anyways, I wanted to, get to, that, wanted to mention that, that I don't go every day, some think I do. Um, anyways, back to some of my future plans. I don't want to get distracted. There's some ideas, some trips I really finally want to do. Um, most of them are going to be in Florida uh, for the time being. Now that I have the move out of the way, uh, mom's situated, taken care of, um, I can finally get going on them. <clears throat> oh, I also wanted to mention another thing. It's bits and delays and some of the things I want to do to the videos. I had some health issues. Mom had some health issues. And then last month, I talked a little bit about this on Facebook. I haven't talked to my channel about it yet. I had a, one of my dogs, Lucky, was diagnosed with cancer. So he had to get surgery to get it removed. It was in his, um, his pinky toe, his paw. Luckily, the, the surgery was a success. We had the test results in. All of it's been removed. So he's cancer free. And we just have to monitor him to make sure he doesn't come back, because you never know. Luckily, Lucky's okay. That's an issue we've been dealing with for a while too, because we weren't sure uh, if that was if it was cancer. It might have been an infection because his paw, or not his paw, his toe swelled up. So we were keeping an eye on it with the vet. Okay. Um, after a while, he thought it's probably cancer. We got some more tests done, and it was. So, yeah. And so he didn't have an easy time, and the surgery is definitely tough on him. He did not like having that cone of shame on his head. I could tell you that. Oh, and let's you know, if you ever get dogs with surgery and have the cone of shame, especially if they drool, they get stinky really quick. So you gotta try to wash them here and around the neck as much as you can, which we had to do after. But anyways, cone of shame's off. His foot, his paw, his toe, everything's fully healed up. So he's in good shape. Anyways. Uh, but like I said, I finally am, uh, think I'm finally ready to take some of those trips, mainly in, mainly here in Florida. I don't want to get too much into it because, it, you know, it could change and all. But um, it's a place I haven't wanted to go forever, so I definitely want to film that. I uh, hope to get back to Disney more regularly, at least once a week. Um, I don't want to... I do a lot of Disney content. Some, Well, at least some has told me. You know, I have 3,000 plus videos. Disney content's probably about getting close to 900 of those. So I suppose that's like one third of all that I have. I don't know. I mean, you could say that's a lot of Disney stuff. I don't know, maybe. But I do want to try to do Disney and some other theme park stuff at least once a week. I do have um, an annual pass to SeaWorld, which I haven't been there forever. But I want to start doing some of that. But I want to mix in some other things. I really miss doing like museums. And historical locations. I know that they're not, how do we say, not the most popular videos, but I still enjoy them and I know a few people out there like watching them, so I'm gonna keep doing them. And I do want to do more drink reviews, which I've uploaded some really cool ones recently. Um, several um, pops from foreign countries, mainly Mountain Dew. And you're gonna have more of those coming up soon. I just have to buy the pop. They're not cheap, they're not easy to get. And you got to be careful. You don't want to just buy them from just anybody. You want to make sure they're a legitimate uh, company or seller. Because I've heard some horror stories from some people who bought them and they never got the pop. The seller kept them and they were out of the pop and the money. So I got to be very careful. But yeah, that's generally been it. Um, like I said, the move and health issues and COVID and everything has been affecting what's been going on with this channel the last several months um, not as much now with the COVID issue but you know you hear about that monkey pox and all that you gotta be careful you know, I'm just gonna go out and just live my life as best as I can you know just keep taking one day at a time putting one step forward that's what you gotta do but uh, yeah I think I covered everything mostly I've been wanting to film this for a while it's just been so busy and um, I just 
I want to make sure I take my time and try to explain things about what's going on. But I appreciate um, all the support I've been getting. Um, yeah. Oh, my birthday was last month, and I didn't say anything on uh, YouTube about it. But I know um, a whole bunch of people on Facebook wish me happy birthday. And I know several of them are subscribers, too. So thank you, everybody, for that. It's really nice. I didn't get the chance to do anything on my birthday. Uh, with Lucky being sick and I'm still deal dealing with the move, I just canceled everything. I was going to eat at Disney and everything. I still intend to eat at Disney for my birthday, even though it won't be on my birthday. I'm hoping to get to it this month. But, of course, you know, I'll vlog that and everything. I don't want to say where I plan to go because I want it to be a surprise. But it will be at Disney. And it's someplace I've been wanting to go forever. But, um, you know, you got to take care of family. And certain life situations are more important than celebrations and all that. Even though I got man, I'm starting to definitely feel a bit old. And that makes me very sad. But this is how it is. Unfortunately, the clock only moves one way forward and you move with it, and you just get older. You know, I, I don't know how it goes with a lot of guys, I'm talking mainly just the men, but with a lot of guys out there, and it definitely knows with me, and I have some others, but you definitely gain right here, and you lose up here. Now, why can't it be the other way around? Why can't I have a big flowing, like, mane of hair, you know, like a, a beautiful hair, like on a horse or something, you know, or Fabio, and then be nice and trimmed down here? I guess too many cheeseburgers in my life and burritos. Mm. I could use a cheeseburger and a burrito now. That definitely doesn't help down here in the waistline. But okay, um, that is it. Any comments, questions, let me know. Um, I'm, I already know once I stop filming, I'm going to think of something. But I should do one of these like update videos every couple months or so. I should I actually should have wrote down like a, a little list of things about what I was going to mention. I know there's others, like I said. But yeah, um, oh, if you watch this, if you're ever in Central Florida, and especially if you have a YouTube channel, even if you don't, you want to hang out, maybe do a vlog or something together, let me know. I'm always looking for um, YouTubers to work with. I haven't been able to get too many um, to hang out with. Uh, there's been a couple who I consider my very good friends um, that I've gone to um, spend some time with, and I... You know who you are. If you if we've hung out together and we communicate uh, online, you know, you know, you're you're the ones. And um, I like to um, hang out with some others and hang out with um, other friends uh, again, um, <clears throat> because I think it's always good to YouTubers collaborating, working together, so we help each other. And I love helping other YouTubers if they're smaller or bigger than me. Doesn't matter. I just love um, hanging out with people and helping others. So hopefully, if you know, if you have a channel. And you want to hang out, maybe do some vlogging, let me know. Um, maybe we, I'm sure we work something out. Okay, um, any comments or questions, anything you want to say, put it below. I said, I'm going to try to do one of these update videos maybe every two or three months. And I'm sure I'm going to think of something as soon as I hang up. And I'm already blabbing too long, probably, because we're at. 13 minutes and 29 seconds. Now it's 13.31, 13.32. Okay. All right. Well, anyways, I have a lot of content coming up, stuff I already filmed. I have a whole backload of stuff. Some going back as several months that I need to just clear off my computer and upload. Actually, I probably have some videos from a couple years even that, I, that one, one or two here that fell, falls between the cracks. If you film as much as I do, and um, because, you know, I film not just out, but I film here at home, it definitely could, um, you could miss some. So, like, I, quickly I want to say, I remember I uploaded a, a Mountain Dew video. What was it? Um, I think it was Holiday Brew, I think it was called. I filmed it in 2017, and it fell between the cracks, and I didn't upload it to YouTube until, <clears throat> like, two or three years later it's just one of those I know there's other videos like that it's definitely fallen between the cracks it just happens so you may see some in older locations or you may see some that's not filmed as well because I'm either less experienced or I used an older camera Oops. Oh. Um, this I tell you this Canon G7X Mark II is definitely a superior camera compared to the first two I used the first two I used was good this is a better camera, and I can see why it's popular with vloggers. 
even though they have a Mark III, but a lot of the Flogger use, uses the Mark II. There's definite advantages to it. I definitely like it. All right, I'm going to go this time. I mean it. Because we're over 15 minutes. But again, thank you for everyone's support, either on Facebook or YouTube. I know there's some um, subscribers that's been with me for a long time. And I appreciate it. Um, you know, the love and support from you guys is just, it means a lot to me. And, um, yeah, I better go before I start getting a little uh, emotional about talking about that. But I do appreciate the support from everyone. All right, got to go. Any comments, questions, put them below. Thanks for watching. Bye, everybody. Bye. Okay, see ya. Thumbs up.